I'm making some mashed potatoes that are beyond cheese. It's like a waterfall of melted cheese with a little bit of potato speckled through it. I mean, it's really cheesy, but it was one of my brother's favorite things to make. It's really easy. Place chopped potatoes into a pot of cold water. Add two garlic cloves, two rosemary sprigs, and some salt. Turn on the heat, bring to a boil, and let it go for another 15 minutes. You'll get the perfect potatoes every time. I'm just ricing the last parts of my potato. Look at that. This ricer makes the potatoes nice and light, which I really like. When I was a kid, my mom used to make them in the vegetable mill, but I find the ricer to be way better than the vegetable mill. There we go. Okay. Now, for the creamy part of the mashed potatoes. We've got one and a half cups of heavy cream that I've been warming. You wanna make sure it's warm because you really wanna melt all the cheeses. Make it nice and creamy. Then we're gonna add some beautiful mozzarella. Now this is a fiore di latte, so it's a certain type of mozzarella that you find here that's very creamy. And you kinda just break it apart. Put that in there. About a cup of Parmesan cheese, freshly grated. And we're gonna add some salt. And to finish it all off, we're gonna add some olive oil. Instead of butter, we're gonna add olive oil. My brother was a huge olive oil guy. And I really like the olive oil in here. It makes it really rich, and hence, being in Tuscany, we're gonna use some olive oil. And then, we're gonna mix it all together. And make it super creamy. Already, you can see it coming together really nicely. Mm. You're gonna start to see when the mozzarella melts how beautiful this is gonna be. That is what reminds me of my brother. That is the love of cheese, right there. All right, gotta make sure that this is just right. Look at, ah. Mm. Oh my God. I mean, if there isn't better comfort food, I don't know, that is the most amazing bite 